Welcome to Electron Online. So, on the previous video, we saw what three industrialized countries used to produce electricity, and primarily it was coal, gas, and nuclear power. And it turns out when we look at the whole world, the picture isn't all that different. Coal is the predominant way in the world for, for power or electricity production. 41% of all the electricity around the world is produced with coal. 22% is used in gas and 11% nuclear with a small 3% for oil. These are all non-renewable sources and it turns out that 77% very close to what we saw in the United States, in the United Kingdom and in Australia for production of electricity which was around 80 or a little bit over 80% of the total. It turns out that hydroelectric power produces 16% of the world's energy or the world's electricity which is great but we've pretty well exhausted the sources of that. There's not a lot of other places where we can build dams, so that's not going to increase by very much. Matter of fact, it's probably going to become a smaller and smaller percentage of the total as the other sources will probably increase to keep up the demand. Notice that wind power, solar, and biomass are still in its infancy when we look at the whole world picture. We know there's some countries that produce a lot of wind power, a lot of solar power, but that those are more the exceptions rather than the rule, and we probably want to see more of that around the world. Biomass, interestingly enough, still outperforms solar in production of electricity around the world, although we hope that in the future we'll have more of the wind power and the solar power to produce electricity. But we have a long ways to go. And whether or not we can ever replace a large significant portion of this using these other forces, sources, that is yet to be seen. We'll just have to see what the future brings us. But that's where we are today around the world.